Oh my gosh, good look out! Oh no. Well, we all died. Hey guys, welcome back to Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. And today, we're gonna completely ignore all these dumb houses for now. And we're gonna go to Farron Woods. But actually first, let's open some of these graves. Move. So I believe if you move all of them, something happens. Don't remember what, but I really... Oh yeah, so you get rupees. And I love my rupees. I'm not gonna do that right now, actually. Because I'm definitely gonna probably get over my max. Okay, he doesn't want to talk to me. No, never mind. Sorry. I had to jump off first. Call him. We need to go into the light. Or, you know. Wait, what's over there? Wait, what? There are different islands? Now I'm curious. Or not. Master can observe the green pillar before you use a column of light. It marks the point in which you can descend to the surface. Wow. Um. Cool. It appears that you will be able to reach reach the surface by passing through the portal in the cloud of the calm base. I don't know, I kind of want to go to this island first. Sorry. I'm really curious of what's over here. No, wait. You know what? I'm not taking that long. Let's go. Bye bye. Goodbye, bird. See you later. I'm going here. I'm not gonna die or anything. Hopefully. I'm definitely not gonna die. Nope. No way, Jose. No way I can die. Not if I've got the sailcloth. 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 Oh, okay. I'm like, really? Not let me use the sailcloth. Hmm. Master Canoe, we've arrived. No, duh. This is the fabled surface that has long been part of the Skyloft legend. Hmm. By my calculations, you are currently positioned in a location known as the Steeled Grounds. Cool. Hmm. We're, we're literally just going in a spiral. Whoa. Sealed grounds. Cool. Cool. I really do like how the maps are in this game. I really do. Please proceed with caution, master. You proceed with caution, dumb, dumb thing. You dumb thing. How dare you. Are you a thingy-majig? Oh, wow. Did I kill him? Wow. That's pretty deadly stuff. How do I get up there? Not doing that anytime soon. Do 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 do. Dude, you suck. I hate you. There we go. Man, I'm really gonna suck at this game, guys. It's true. 
Um, jump. That sound seems like a good idea. Not sure I'm getting them back up, but who cares? We're in the sealed grounds, and that's all that matters. What the heck is that? That doesn't look very good. Um. That looks not good. Whoa. Um. Oh, hey. How you doing? Ow. Am I getting like a nightmare? I don't understand. Oh, hey. Hey, how you doing? Ow. Um. Oh, okay. Dream? Nightmare? Nightmare, okay. Nightmare. Nightmare. Um, I kinda don't wanna go there. There's wind. There's a leaf. I've never seen a leaf before, <laughs> says Link. Oh my gosh. Link, you're a dumb butt. Just kidding, Link, you're okay. Will this grow back? I'm wondering. Maybe you have to wait. Cutting the grass, cutting the grass. Cutting, 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 cutting the grass. I am cutting the grass. Yeah, yeah, yes. Do I? Can I even open this? Yeah. I'm not opening that anytime soon. Run. Do I want to go up here? Ooh. Hey there. Well, that's how I get back. Don't really want to go back right now, though. I need a key. Run. Looks like there's also... Oh, yeah. So what's over here? Okay. Cool. Again, guys, this probably won't be 100%. But almost definitely won't, because this is literally my first time ever playing the game. This is completely blind. I'm just going to play this for fun. Hopefully I'll find some cool stuff. This is a whole enemy. No, it's just a random hole. Oh, we can just keep on sprinting because there's these. Awesome. I don't know, because I know you can collect bugs and stuff, and I saw... Whoa, what's that up there? Oh, is that a heart container? Dude, that's our first heart piece. It's not a heart container, it's a heart piece. I'm going to try to collect a bunch of these heart pieces. I don't think I'll collect a lot of uh, everyone, but I do want to collect a bunch. Well, that's not a heart piece. Darn it. I think there's a heart piece somewhere. Ugh. Oh well. What's up here? Run. You're not a heart piece either. You're a nothing. You're not helpful at all. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna need bombs for that. Hmm. What are all these holes for? What, I ask you, what? I'm curious. Those are all hearts. Why are there so many hearts? I have no idea, really. Let's go up here. There's like nothing up here. 
What the heck? Bruh. Run. Run. Why am I doing this? Is there even a reason to... Okay, this doesn't look safe. Young one. Child of destiny descended from the sky. Hey, that's me. I bet. Raise the sword of the goddess. Skyward. Take aim at the evil aura and unleash its power. I don't know. Unleashing something doesn't sound like a good idea. No, I wasn't close enough. There we go. Will that make it light? Oh, yes, it will. Well, that's good. I fixed it. Ooh. Well, that does. So that's what all those holes were. I was gonna say. It's kind of weird. Master Kano, I'm sensing a change in the area that was triggered by your Skyward Strike. I have also detected an ore that correlates closely to your sail clock. I surmise this ore belongs to Zelda. I can lead you in the direction of this ore through a process known as dowsing. Would you like me to explain this process to you? Dowsing? Nah. Understood, Master. What? Oh, okay. Hold down C and select Zelda as your dowsing target, then point in the direction you wish, wish to search. I can already find Zelda? Wait, what? Dows? Where are you? Zelda. Zelda. Where are you, Zelda? Yeah, you're not anywhere here. No way, Jose. You're like the whole reason we're doing this game. Keep going. We. Whoa, that's not good. How? Jerk. Oh, so that's how you get on top of all of all that stuff. I get it now. Hmm. Well. Man, Link, you get really tired pretty fast. It's kind of annoying. Come on, Link. Let's go. I see sparklies. Is that just this game being this game? Yes, it is. This wall is sparkly looking, I swear. I'm not making anything up. Now where the heck do I go? Well, that's just great. I did that, so now what do I do? Hmm. That looks like something over there. What if I use my Skyward Strike on this? Oh, or I just walk or near it. Oh, it's lo it's unlocked. Cool. Let's go in then. Where does this go? Where does this go? You'll never know. Sealed temple. It's the first temple, guys. That's another hole. Wait, is this actually the first temple? I have no idea. I don't think I'm ready for the first temple. Oh, hey, old lady. Or, old... thing. Yeah. Ah, the traveler descended from the clouds above. I welcome you, child of fate. 
Dude, you look, uh, really, really old. Tell me, what is your name? Canil, all good. Canil, good, very good. I sense you have already gained control over the sacred power that fills your sword when pointed to Scourward. The Scourward Strike is in your command. It is proof that you are fit to bear the blade you carry, the goddess sword. I have sat here for many years waiting for you to arrive. All so that I could fulfill my purpose as your guide. Oh my gosh. I'd never do that. I'm sorry. You stand under the roof of the sealed temple, a place built by the goddess an eternity ago. Your arrival here was predestined many, many years ago. The spirit maiden you seek arrived here shortly before you, descending to this land in a shower of light. There's no doubting it. The gears of fate have begun to turn. Yet all is not as it should be. The spirit maiden was not meant to reach this land in the manner she did. I feel an evil power working in the shadows. It moves to warp the destiny of which you two are a part. Knil, you are concerned for the spirit maiden and seek her whereabouts, yes? That is understandable, but for now you must focus on moving forward. That girl has her own purpose she must pursue, as do you. She set out for Farron Woods to discover that destiny for herself, and you must follow. Show me your map. Okie dokie. Hey, that's Farron Woods. Cool. An X upon your map marks the path that will lead you to Farron Woods. You will be traveling in unfamiliar land. Many monsters have settled here, and a map may not prove guidance enough for your journey. And so I will give you the power to create beacons. When a beacon is marked on your map, a column of light will stand at that location. It will act as your waypoint at, from afar. Point to the X and press C to place the beacon. Okay, my pointer is very messed up. Though you cannot see it from where we are, a beacon stands outside to guide you. Leave the temple through the front doors and see for yourself. When you no longer have a use for a beacon, you can remove it from your map by just pressing C. Use your beacons well and you will never fear getting lost. Go now, you must head into the Aaron Woods and chase after the spirit maiden. The way you go, Zelda. On your way out, take the contents of the treasure chest within this room. What you find there should prove useful on your journey. Uh. Okay. Oh, hey. She unlocked the door. You already leave the door. Okay, so there's a treasure chest. Know that all the questions you have now will be answered in time. For now, can you go bravely? Well, first, I want your treasure. There it is. Hey there. Whoa. Fully replenishes your shield gauge and also restores four hearts. That's pretty cool, dude. Is there another, is there another chest? Cause that'd be swag diggity. It'd be swag diggity dog, dude. Nope. You know, what the heck is that? Okay, is that a fairy? Now I'm just wondering what does a fairy do? Fairy? Six. Well, there it goes. Wait. What? I do hope you are able to catch up with Zelda. She just talks to me when I sit? What's up here? What the heck? I'm so confused. Why is there so many benches? There's a bug! How cool, I guess. I don't know. Sure. Really? Okay. Do do do. I'm not gonna go to the Farren Woods this episode, but I just wanna check outside before we actually move into the Farren Woods to see if there's anything cool there. Oh, there's a cutscene, I guess. So there's Beacon, which you can definitely see. Wow. I, I believe those are also going to be in Zelda U. So that's pretty cool. You're going to need it a lot more in Zelda U, I'm guessing, because... Uh... 
I believe. I'm pretty sure that, uh... It's gonna be a really big world. A very, very big world. Very, 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 very big world. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I just wanted to record some Skyward Sword today. Are those Gorons? Those are enemies. You know, is there a chest? We're gonna do that next. Oh, that is a Goron! Okay, before we finish this episode, I have to help him. Out of the way, scram. Dude, I love Gorons! Get out of here, goblin. Ooh. I did good. Woo, thanks for jumping in there to rescue me, bud. Dude, you're so cool! I love Gorons! Just who were those red pests? I did not expect to run into a pack of them in this peaceful forest. Same goes for you. This is the second time I've bumped into one of your kind today. I tell you, all sorts of weird things are going on lately. I owe you big for taking care of those guys, so let me tell you something fascinating. Oh, we can save right there. Awesome. Hey bud, I'm Go I am Ger Gorko the Goron. I'm researching the ancient history of these woods here. According to the ancient text, there is some kind of place up above called the Isle of the Goddess, fair up in the sky. Apparently these old statues serve as landmarks to those traveling up to the sky or down from the Isle of the Goddess place. If you find one, be sure to examine it to keep tabs on the number of landmarks. There are rumors to be quite useful. What? Aw, oh, dude. Otherwise, all these statues, why would they all be? It's a real head-scratcher, bud. Makes you want to know more, does it not? Not really. I can figure it out myself. Sorry, dude. I'm gonna touch it, though. Or maybe not. Whoa. What in the world just happened? Did you see some kind of magic? That Sorry, I was cut off. But, uh, but I think I'm not the same exact line anyway. Statue reacted the moment you got near it, bud. How crazy is that? Pretty crazy. Hopefully this is a safe thing. That'd be great. To the sky, save, save and quit. That's gonna be a save and quit, guys. Next time we're gonna go to Farron Woods and see what that's all about. Because I'm pretty excited about that. Thank you all for watching this episode of Legends of the Skyward Sword. I probably will finish Mario Party 8 today. Because, um... I want to finish it... Pretty fast. The Mario Party games. Because... I don't know. I just feel like it. And I can. And buy. <laughs> Go to Farron Woods and search for Zelda. That I will. That I will.